He's way down there too. Oh, he's taking me Do we have to him. chase him? No, I'm trying to keep him up here. Oh, dude, that's a big fish. Is it? Yeah. Oh yeah, there it is. Can't bring him up, huh? Oh, dude, this fish got power. Ready, John? I'm gonna bring it right to you. Ooh, All right. dude. Oh, look, actually, that is a tiger. Is it? Is it? Tiger. That'd be my first tiger <laughs> ever. <laughs> All right, just hero drifted this hole and bam, bobber down right at the tail out. Thought I was snagged, and guess what? I got my first ever tiger trout. Gorgeous fish, probably, I don't know, 18 inch fish. Good, healthy fish. We're gonna get him home, and uh, guess what? Maybe we'll get another one. Hey everybody, Chris Shea for Apotsky Outdoors. It is the dead of winter right now. Weatherman said there was gonna be no snow today. As you can see, the snow is starting to fall. We figured that would be a great idea for us to come out here and do a little trout fishing. Why? One, because we all love fishing. Two, because it's NFL playoff weekend. You know what that means? That means everybody is inside watching the football game. So we gotta stream all to ourselves. We're gonna come out here today with two baits, Natural Deluxe and Potsky Pink Shrimp Balls of Fire Salmon Eggs. See if we can get some trout to bite. Come on in, you guys are warm watching this. We're out here in temperatures that are just below freezing, chasing rainbows. That's a nice fish. Ooh, look at the colors on that, Big Mike. Ooh, it's a brown, it's a brown. A nice brown trout caught on a Potsky's pink shrimp egg. We're gonna put him back for another day. We're using a little bit heavier line on the main line. It's a 10 pound test, but guess what? I had a little bit of leader line left in my bag. So a little fixed float, fishing about three foot of water in a couple of these holes, maybe four foot. A couple split shots to keep that float vertical up and down in the water column. And then just taper them off down to a four pound leader. You know, this water is gem clear in the winter time. Not very high. Uh, a couple split shots, maybe about 18 inches away from my hook, which is a size 12 Gamagatsu. And then I got a natural deluxe has been uh, the key ticket today. Oh, look at that brown. All right, look at the spots. Man, beautiful butterball. This is a nice wild fish. Can't believe he picked it up. You know, probably 14 inch fish, bobber down. It's nice to always catch a wild butter. Check out this pretty rainbow we just got. Natural Deluxe, bobber down. As you see, there's some real shallow water up there and it comes down and once you know, it just drops off to a good pocket and it comes back up in the tail out, you know. We're using a little bit of a small float because the water's not that big as you see and it's gem clear and I like to get that first reaction bite of this fish, you know. So let's see what we can do. As you see, you know, that far side is definitely the heavier spot over there because it's a lot deeper over there. Fling it over there. You know, we're only drifting 10 yard section at the most. Hold on. We're keeping our float on because we're also keeping our egg up off the water, in the water column. You know, these fish are in the winter time usually deeper, but I like to keep them up off the bottom. We lose less gear and, you know, make this fish eat those eggs. I don't know what it is. It's decent. Have you seen it? Yeah, it's a decent fish. Right down the center. Just freaking letting her go. I don't want to walk down there to spook the fish out, you know what I mean? I don't know if they're getting a little freaky with foot action going on, so I just drifted it as far as I can down the center, and uh, this little guy picked it up. Looks like a little wild mm -hmm. brown. Another brown? Stop brown. And I may be mistaken, but I think that's a natural deluxe that is still in his mouth. Look at that. Ooh, not an easy angle. Oh, it's Looks like a nice brown trout in the net. 
Good colors. Yeah. Look at that. Mr. Brown. I don't think you're gonna leave those naturals home there next time, Big Mike. I don't think it's a monster, but it looks to be a pretty fish. Well, compared to his last one. Nice rainbow. Hmm. Come on, John. Oh, Lord, please stay with me. Yeah. <laughs> and action. Oh, yes. Finally. All right, after riding the struggle bus for quite a long time now, I finally got a nice drift on the Natural Deluxe and he came out and picked him up. What a beautiful brown. Real light colors. Ooh, he ain't huge, but you know what? Pretty. He's pretty. You know what? That's one more than John. Yeah. All right, we're catching all the species today. As you see, we just called a brook trout. Man, fast, last final drifts and uh, Bob are down. As you see, John just picked one up. We got this brook trout, we're gonna send him home. Today's episode of Potsky Outdoors comes to you from beautiful trout country here in the dead of winter. You know, honestly, winter is one of our favorite times to film Potsky Outdoors. Reason being, there's snow on the ground, temperatures just below freezing where we are today, and nobody else is out fishing because of us. Now, one of the great things about fishing during this time of year is fishing pressure is so low, and you know what? The trout still eat. And you know when they eat, especially when there's natural deluxe and pink shrimp salmon eggs in the water. Those are the two that we use today, and it basically put us an opportunity to catch four species, which we did today. You'll see we caught brook trout, rainbow trout, brown trout, and the rare tiger trout. Now we're fishing a stock section of Treek today on public access roads. Uh, we're right in the middle of town. Ironically, this stream has not been stocked since, that's right, May. We're in the middle of January right now. The stream hasn't been stocked since May, and you know what? With good bait today, we were able to come out here, use light line, catch some really nice, hard fight aggressive rainbows even in the dead of winter last light buddy. every time we say we're gonna leave you hook up another brown trout look at that <laughs> another beautiful brown trout Oh, <laughs> my